Happening today, the bitter cold isn't stopping thousands of people from attending the Women's March in Chicago. It kicks off in just a few hours from Grant Park. CBS 2's V Win live right now at Grant Park with a look at the focus of this year's march. V. Suzanne, good morning. Yeah, the barricades are already set up for this march. Organizers are calling this an anniversary march, and it's going to be different compared to previous years. This year, they won't have a stage or speakers. The plan is to march from Grand Park to Federal Plaza with elected officials, many of them women. Now, this was the march in 2018 when 300,000 people showed up fighting for different issues. In 2017, it was a quarter of a million. The focus of this year's march has been narrowed down to five key issues. Climate justice, gun violence prevention, the 2020 census, health care access, and voting. Organizers are urging people to get involved and to head to the polls in November, saying the top priority is moving the Trump administration out of the White House. The plan now is to send 500,000 postcards to Wisconsin to get voters out for the primary on April 7th. Women care about what's happening in the country. We care about what's happening in the White House. We need all of those folks and all those voices together to make sure that we are building bomb policy that is going to take this country to the next height. Now, the march steps off at 11 at Columbus Drive and Jackson Street. Mayor Lori Lightfoot, Cook County President Tony Preckwinkle, and state's attorney Kim Fox will lead the march. Reporting live from Grant Park, V1 CBS 2 News. Thanks so much, V.